In this video, we are going to complete the book exercise of poem My Mother. Everybody open page number 82. Your first question, circle the correct words within the brackets. The mother would shed tears of joy while watching her baby sleep. The mother taught the child how to play. The mother would always listen to anything the child said. The mother would run to help when the child fell down. The mother kissed the child when she got hurt. The child can never be cruel to her mother. Now let's do B question answers in English to copy. Who slept in a cradle bed? The baby poet slept in the cradle bed. Write three things that the poet's mother did for her when she was a child. The poet's mother dressed her doll, taught her to play and listened to all her talk. Your third question, what does the poet mean by minded all I had to say? The poet means that the poet's mother listened to all the things that the poet wanted to say. What did the child's mother do for her when she fell? The child's mother ran to help her stand when she fell. Why can the poet never stop being affectionate and kind to her mother? The poet can never stop being affectionate and kind to her mother because she was very kind to her. Now come back to page number 82. Your C question is use the clues to complete the word pyramid. A crowd, mob. Night insect, moth. January is one of these month. She loves you or best of all, mother. The early part of the day, morning. A very high place to climb, mountain. Tick the correct words within the brackets. This is a quiet Q-U-I-E-T neighborhood. We have lived here for quite a long time. Q-U-I-T-E. I have two T-W-O-2 dogs. They are too wild, T-W-O, wild to live inside the house. This is their house, T-H-E-I-R, their house. Our house is over there, T-H-E-R-E. Come on page number 83. We have already A-L-R-E-A-D-Y finished packing. We are all ready to leave. This book has a few loose pages. Please don't lose any of them. Your gramophone which comes under your English one. Fill in the blanks with the L-Y forms or the words in the bracket. Means soft, softly, neat, neatly, loving, lovingly, quick, quickly, loud, loudly. Your uh, Radha writes neatly. Jasbi speaks softly. The proud father held his baby lovingly. Tara slammed the door loudly and ran out of the room. Fali dressed quickly and ran out to catch the school bus. Your F question is, circle the adverbs of place in these sentences. Now what are adverbs? Adverbs are the words which adds meaning to the verb. The sun shines, shines is your verb, shines where, everywhere, place, adverb of place, everywhere is your adverb. Mother is working upstairs, working where, upstairs, where is mother working, upstairs, so upstairs is your adverb of place. You go ahead and I will follow you, go where, ahead of you, simmer, had lived here most of her life. Lived where? Here. Here is your adverb of place. It is about to rain. Don't go outside. Where not to go? Outside. So, adverb of place. Now, circle the adverbs of time in these sentences. Palash will come today. When will Palash come? Today. So, today is your adverb of time. We got up late and missed the bus. When did the person, when did the people got up? Late. So late is your adverb of time. Yuv really writes to his mother. How many times does Yuv writes to his mother? Rarely. So rarely is your adverb of time. 
My father takes the metro to work daily. How many times does father takes the metro to work? Daily. So daily is your adverb of time. Please tidy up your room immediately. Immediately is your adverb of time. It wasn't this hot yesterday. Yesterday is your adverb of time. With this I finish your I finish your poem my mother your home assignment is to read the poem and complete your book and copy work neatly and correctly thank you that's all for today take care god bless you all